Rivers rejoice. Nearly 10,000 brown brook and rainbow trout are now swimming in streams and waterways across western New York after they were, you see it there, released yesterday. The DEC releases the hatchery raised fish every year. This is all to encourage fishing and that fishing fever has enthusiasts ready to grab their poles. And businesses are eager to reap the benefits from this sport. Seven Eyewitness News reporter Liz Lewin live for us at the Buffalo Harbor bundled up looking at how fishing impacts western New Yorkers. Hi Liz. Well, Ed and Katie, Katie, you said it right. Fishing fever has hit Western New York. Now, you may not be able to see those fish behind me here in the Outer Harbor, but I can guarantee you they are swimming in there and they are happy. And they're not the only ones. Fisher is also happy after the DEC released thousands of brown brook and rainbow trout into 50 streams across Western New York yesterday. So the breakdown, more than 2,000 released into Hyde Park Lake and Gill Creek in Niagara County and more than 8,000 in Lake Erie and the Buffalo River, which means, hey, parents, if your kids are gearing up for spring break, what better time to hit the water with them than right now? All you got to do is grab some warm rain gear with you. We caught up with Niagara Falls Mayor Paul Deister yesterday who says the sport of fishing is something every kid deserves to try at least once. For kids in the inner city, the opportunity to catch a trout like this may be the beginning of uh, you know, a hobby that in 10 years will bring them down to the base of the gorge fishing for you know 10-pound steelhead. So parents, how can you turn fishing into a family friendly event? Well, the DEC has a few tips for you to keep in mind as you head out. Make sure that the trip is all about your kids. Try and keep these trips relatively short so they don't tire out. And you want to let them make the most decisions as possible when it comes to casting the lounge and picking their fish. Also, be sure to bring the right equipment. Also, some other things to keep in mind. Hey, if your kids or your teens are under the age of 16, some good news for you out there. They do not need a fishing license, but you parents and guardians out there, you do need one. I'll post more information from the DEC on fishing on our website at WKBW.com. You can also grab it on our app. Live in the Buffalo Harbor, Liz Lewin, 7 Eyewitness News. All right, Liz, thank you very much. My